Hello students, today we are going to study discharge through open channels by Chiji's formula. Consider uniform flow of water in a channel as shown in figure which is shown here. As the flow is uniform, it means that the velocity, depth of flow and area of flow will be constant for a given length of channel. Now consider section 11 and 22 which is shown here that is section 11 and that is section 22. Now L is the length of channel which is shown here, A is the area of flow of water, I is the slope of the bed, V is the mean velocity of flow of water, P is the wetted perimeter of the cross section, F is the frictional resistance per unit velocity per unit area. Now weight of water between section 11 and 22 will be equals to W that is specific weight of water into volume of water. Now specific weight of water is indicated by W that is small w and volume of water will be indicated by area into length. Now component of W along direction of flow will be equals to W sin i which is shown here. Now the value of W will be equals to small w al into sin i which is the first equation. Now frictional resistance against motion of water will be equals to F into surface area into velocity to the power n. Now the value of n is found experimentally equals to 2 and surface area will be equals to P into L. So therefore frictional resistance against motion will be equals to FPL V square that is the second equation. Now forces acting on the water between section 11 and 22 are component of weight of water along the direction of flow, frictional resistance against the flow of water, pressure force at section 11 and pressure force at section 22. Now as the depth of water at the section 11 and 22 are the same, the pressure force on these two sections are the same and acting in the opposite direction. Hence they cancel each other. In case of uniform flow, the velocity of flow is constant for the given length of the channel. Hence there is no acceleration acting on the water. Hence the resultant force acting in the direction of flow must be 0. Therefore, resolving all forces in the direction of flow, we get WAL sin i minus FPL V square will be equals to 0. Therefore, the value of WAL sin i will be equals to FPL V square. Now, V square will be equals to WAL sin i upon FPL. On solving this, we will have V equals to under root of W by F into under root of A by P into sin i where A by P equals to M that is hydraulic mean depth or hydraulic radius and under root of W by F is equals to C that is Tg's constant. Now substituting the value of A by P and under root of W by F in equation third we will get V equals to C under root M sin I. Now for a small value of I sin I will be equals to tan I which will be equals to I. Therefore equation becomes V equals to C under root M I. Now for finding the discharge which will be equals to area into velocity, we will have area equals to A and velocity will be equals to C under root Mi. That will be the discharge through open channels by Chiji's formula. That is all about this topic. Thank you very much students.